Hi everyone, my name is Alistair Bate and I'm a Cloud Optimization Solution Architect at AWS. And today I'm joined by from Jesse from Nero. Thanks for being here today. Yeah, great to be here, Alistair. Thanks for having me. No problem. So as you probably heard, uh, the Cloud Adoption Framework comes with two key workshops that helps our customers drive, identify their business outcomes for adopting cloud and actually accelerating their projects. And the question we always get is, how do you do these workshops in a virtual environment or with teams separated for, by long distances? And today, I have the pleasure of sitting down with Jesse to talk through how Miro can help. Jesse, do you mind just introducing yourself and giving us a bit of background about Miro? Yeah, I'd be happy to, Alistair. Uh, hi, everybody. My name is Jesse Greenhouse, and I'm our cloud solutions lead here at Miro. Uh, and my role is really to help take our products and features and put them together in a way that help customers accelerate cloud transformation engagements. If you're not familiar with Miro, uh, we're actually a virtual collaboration tool that was founded back in 2011. Uh, we pride ourselves on bringing the online whiteboard uh, to market. But if you fast forward to today, we are so much more than just an online whiteboarding tool. We have built the innovation workspace, helping teams to create the next big thing. Um, and I'm super excited to talk about how you can leverage our platform to accelerate hybrid cloud adoption framework workshops. Wonderful. So I guess the, the key question is, what does a CAF template look like on Miro and how can our customers and our partners make use of that today? Yeah, absolutely. So what we're going to show you is how you can leverage something that we've recently released uh, called a blueprint. And a blueprint is a ready-made space template within Miro that has all of the content pre-populated, ready to actually execute a cloud adoption framework in one place from documentation, presentations, to actually areas where you can do the work, all of this can be readily available within our platform. Let's take a look. So the first thing that you're gonna wanna do to access these templates is open up a Miro board, as you can see here. And what you're gonna do is go over to the left-hand side where we have the templates picker. Once we click templates, you're gonna see blueprints. And there's a lot of great blueprints in here for you to look at, but for today, we wanna to focus in on the AWS CAF workshops. And if we click Use Blueprint, you can see that there is already a um, area where you can read more about this. But for the purposes of the demo, let's just jump right in. And you can see that if I hit Create Blueprint, it says this is going to create a space with 14 boards. And it's actually broken out to not only give you the documentation needed to do the workshop, but as Alistair said, we have areas for the envisioning and the alignment workshop readily available within the platform. Yeah, and I guess the big thing is a lot of our facilitators who run CAF workshops need a bit of a reminder or maybe for the first time, a guidance on actually how to run the workshops. And these space templates give an idea of exactly what's in there and how to take you through it all. 100%. So if we quickly just open it up to give everyone a quick overview, um, what this is actually going to do is it's going to build out all of this content ready for you. So before, we only had singular templates that you could put in an individual board. And now with these blueprints, you can actually have a series of boards that are pre-populated and created for you to actually execute the workshop. So here you can see we're dropped right into a document where you can read more about the CAF workshops. And on the left-hand side, we have all of our content readily available from the pre-read section to the envisioning workshop all the way through to the alignment workshop. Um, and you can do things like actually set the workshop up for success where you have checklists that you need to go through. You have to-do lists where you can start to execute task management. Um, if we move forward, there's even presentations that you can jump right into a dedicated presentation view where you can start to actually run this right from your um, computer. And so you don't even have to think about any of this setup. It's all built out for you. And then obviously, with Miro being a virtual collaboration tool, we have the pre-populated spaces for you to actually execute the workshop as well with prescriptive guidance based on AWS best practices. It's wonderful. And I know there's already some great examples in there. We've been working really hard to make sure there's guidance in, in there. And there's a lot of information to make sure your customers and the teams you're running workshops with will get an idea of how the cloud adoption framework will help them accelerate their migrations. Well, thank you very much, Jesse. Uh, these are available for you to go ahead and install and run on your uh, Miro spaces today. So if there's any questions, of course, reach out. But otherwise, go ahead, get started and run these. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks so much for having me. Cheers.